Hello guys, welcome to another Ross Perry Productions video. In this video I have a 2021 Toyota Corolla and I'm going to show you where each of the fluid top-up locations are. So obviously to do this we have to go underneath the bonnet and to get there we're going to open up the driver's door fully, come down into the footwell and pull this lever here, then go back around to the front of the car and we're going to open up the bonnet by a lever just above the Toyota badge, push that to the left and then we're going to put this bonnet stay in that hole there. Once your bonnet's safe and secure we can just have a look around the engine bay and I'll just show you some of the main items. So this is your battery, this is your main fuse box, this is your air box where your air filter is kept, there's another smaller accessory fuse box there but like I say, this video is mainly around the top-up locations. So your fluid top-up for the windscreen washer fluid is here. And you can actually use the dip stick to find out how much fluid's in there or how much water's in there. I recommend you use the, uh, the actual diluted solution or the one that you actually mix with water. This is your coolant, so you want to make sure that your coolant level is between the minimum and maximum down there. And I would always recommend checking out which coolant your car takes rather than just putting water in there. Now the next one is oil. So we've got the oil dipstick just here. So what you'd do is you'd take this out, you would clean it off and then you'd lower it back in. And you can see the two dots at the bottom there. You want to make sure the oil line is between those two dots. If it is low, then we're going to need to top up the oil, which is done via this oil cap here. And then we're just going to put the oil in there, making sure we, we're checking on the dipstick at the oil level to make sure we don't overfill it. Now you'll notice that there's no power steering reservoir on this car, and that's because it has electronic power steering, so we don't have to worry about topping that up. But we do have a slightly hidden reservoir here, so we're just going to undo three clips and that rotates up and then this is our brake fluid reservoir. So again, we just want to make sure on the side there's a maximum there that our brake fluid is always towards the maximum and looking at the cap, this car uses a dot free brake fluid so make sure you only put dot free brake fluid in there and make sure the cap is nice and sealed as well before rotating this down and clipping it in. Now you can actually see the level there without removing this, but you won't be able to get the cap off. So there we go, that's each of the fluid top up locations on a 2021 Toyota Corolla. If you found this video helpful, please go ahead, give me the thumbs up, leave me a comment down below, check out some of my other videos and subscribe to my channel.